you guys and welcome back to another video as you guys know valentine's day is really right around the corner so i figured let's do some valentine's day gift ideas under 50 dollars. all right starting with number one i'm gonna go basic and then kind of build my way up from there but this is not in order either so it's just it's really my ideas of what i thought would be different but then also add some basics to it like if you're building a basket I wanted to include some basics in there that everyone knows. And number one, I put Lindor chocolates. Now, I don't know if everyone's tried these chocolates, but me, I love me some Lindor chocolates. So let me show y'all because I actually have some chocolates with me. These are it, okay? These are everything. And I'm not going to sit here and lie and say these aren't expensive because these are a little pricey for some chocolates, but don't be mistaken these are not basic chocolates okay these are the elite for me and these don't have any nuts in them they also have different tastes like white chocolate some of them that have nuts i think i don't know these are my favorite ones if you know someone that likes chocolate and just chocolate and they like that milky taste to it listen it says milk okay it says milk listen to the packaging okay because it's so good i love these I think this bag this big regularly regularly runs for maybe 11, 12, maybe 14. It just depends on the size, really. You can get something smaller for less, but it's still going to be a little pricey for some chocolates. But, you know, Valentine's Day is once a year, so got to come out your pocket for these, okay? And if someone doesn't like Lindor chocolates, I know I feel like a lot of people like the Ferrero Rocher chocolates. I'll insert a picture because I don't know if I'm saying it right. My mom loves those. I personally do not. I don't really like nuts. So that's also another option. And I know that Five Below sells them in a little heart container. Now, because they sell them in a heart container, that's going to be a little more expensive. But, you know, Valentine's Day. Number two, I feel like you can't really go wrong with this item. Some fussy socks, you know. Like I said, we're, we're building up the basket, okay? Come on now. Who doesn't like some fussy socks? Number three. And this one I had to research because I personally don't shop here, but you can find some stuff under $50. Pandora bracelets. Now don't come for me saying that there are no bracelets under $50 because I went on the Pandora website and there was some. It wasn't a lot, but there was some, okay? It's the effort that counts and they weren't ugly either. So number four, we have a snack care package. Now what this is essentially is basically just a big box of snacks. So technically you can go your own route and build different snacks up together and just build it up until it gets to below fifty dollars or if you want to make it easier on you you can go on amazon and literally search up snack care package and something should come up to where you get a lot of options and you pick out a i guess box with a bunch of snack options so you can do that as well and it would be less than fifty dollars i think the ones that I was seeing were $40, so if you have someone that loves snacks like me, then I think that would be a great gift idea. Number five, paying someone's subscription to something. Now, you can either, I guess, pay it for them if you can, or just gift that to them in a card. And if you have somebody that's a gamer, you can also gift them a Game Pass. Now, if we want to stick to our $50 budget, then you can get an Xbox Game Pass for six months for $40. Okay. Number six, a promise ring. And again, I put Pandora and Zales because I know Zales definitely has some things that are below $50 that you can find. But also Pandora, surprisingly. They don't have a lot of rings, but they have some. And they weren't ugly. Number seven. Now, when I came across this, I was just like, ooh, that's so cool. Cash money candles. So what you do is, you know, you buy this candle and it's what it, it is what it is. It's a candle, right? You know, you turn it on, you... You put the flame on it, you know, it's, it's, it's doing its thing, it's being a candle, it's burning, whatever, whatever. Well, you know, as the wax goes down, there's actual money. It depends on who you order these cash money candles from, depending on how much money you'll get. The one that I'm going to list, I think it's really cool because it has happy birthday, different scents, lavender is personally probably going to be my favorite because I like that type of smell. And, you know, you get more than just... A little couple of dollars. I believe you can get fives, you can get two, so it's a mystery. It's kind of like a mystery box too. You don't know how much money you're going to get. 
and all of the candles listed from the website is going to be $40. Number eight, we have an explosion box set. So what this is, is one of those boxes that, you know, you open it up and bam, it pops out. Now, I have something kind of like that, so let me show you. So when I became a citizen, my mom gifted me this box. And now, this is something that one of her friends makes. But you can also, like I said, find this on Amazon. So bam, you pop it open and bam, it's supposed to explode. But this one's a little different. But I think the ones that they have on Amazon would plop out fully. Now, this one plops out, you know not all the way but you can see you can get the picture and then this part would go down as well this one doesn't do that but I know the ones on Amazon do so you know it's very unique got these fake <laughs> at the fake little flowers up there and then you can customize the pictures like it was done here and then you can put whatever you want and at the bottom it says congrats to US citizen you know it's a it's such a cute personalized <laughs> gift and I didn't even know this was here Wow. <laughs> I didn't even know that was there. Wow. Okay. Well, I'm going to have to give this to her because I don't even like the Ferrero Rocher. But okay, but see, these are the ones that I was talking about. These are the Ferrero Rocher. It's such a cute little unique gift idea. And it shows that you put a lot of effort into it because, you know, you're going to get, you're going to have to go buy pictures for it. And it's a very cute personalized box that you can have for the rest of your life. Number nine, a customized Funku. Pop. This is a Funku Pop. So what you can do is go on the Funku website and basically customize anyone. You can customize yourself, your friend, your boyfriend, anybody. You can customize whoever you want all for $40. And I will say shipping is not free, but it's also not crazy out your pocket like I said because I'm pretty sure the total is either 40 or 45 dollars and when you're checking out and being done with customizing the pop you can also include the name of the person that you're doing this for so I think it is a very great idea not only is it a great Valentine's Day gift idea but also I would think I think it would make a great unique birthday gift idea as well because I don't know about you, but I would love somebody to gift me a Funko Pop of me. That's that's so cute. If you don't want to customize anybody, you can also, if they are a pop fanatic, you can actually just go and gift them a pop. Might even be less than $40 depending on the one that they want. Number 10. And this is something that you can get from Amazon. A butterfly in a jar. I think it is so gorgeous and it's exactly as the name implies. It's a butterfly in a mason jar basically. And so it's not a real butterfly. It's not a real butterfly. It's a, I guess, make-believe butterfly. But it just looks so real and it just looks so pretty and I love it. I don't know anybody that owns a butterfly in a jar so this can be a unique idea number 11 you can go to build a bear and build a bear now i did some research and the range of building a bear can range from 14 dollars to 40 dollars and if you really really want to go out your way after the build a bear you can also add a sound so maybe it's of you saying i love you so every time you touch the bear it says i love you or whatever you want to say you adding a little sound box to the bear will be an additional ten dollars so with that being said let's say that your bear costs forty dollars and then you want to add the sound that'll be fifty dollars in total so just right there at our max budget and i don't believe that includes the clothing or the shoes so didn't include that in there number 12 a personalized neon sign now if you are with somebody that is an entrepreneur not even that I think neon signs are so in right now that I think it looks like everyone's getting them so you can give somebody a neon sign of their name or their brand name if they just opened up a store I believe Etsy has a lot of great deals I just went on their website and they had a lot of deals on a lot of the neon signs different people obviously guys please look at the reviews before you make a purchase and yeah last but not least a disposable Kodak camera I think it would be really cute because I feel yes we can take pictures with our iPhone but it's something about a disposable camera and taking pictures on it that just looks so imperfect and more memorable I don't know it kind of feels like you're taking pictures 
in an old camera. You know what I mean? And with that being said, that concludes our Valentine's Day gift ideas under 50. If you enjoyed this video, please make sure to give it a thumbs up, comment, share, subscribe, and most of all, your tia, your abuela, tell everybody, and I'll see you next time. Bye. All right, I accidentally forgot to include two other ones that I wanted to mention. One, a personalized lighter. If you have somebody that likes to smoke cigarettes or whatever else they smoke, if you catch my drift, then a personalized lighter would be awesome. A lighter of you, of their dog, whatever. Just something personalized. And that way, also, nobody can steal their lighter because why do you have a lighter with my girlfriend's face on it? And then another honorable mention is a Lego set. Now, I will insert pictures of several ones because I know that Legos can be expensive, but lucky for us, there are a couple that are under 50 or almost just at that bracket. And no, we are not calculating tax in this video. No tax. <laughs> so I will include that as well. Thank you so much once again. And if you made it all the way to here, see, I know you're a real... You're a real one because you made it all the way to the end. <laughs>